Hi. JD AdWords Enterprise One Search enables you to perform an easy and quick search across tables or business views for data that meets your search criteria. In this tutorial, we'll see how to use some of the Enterprise One search features that are available starting with tools release 9.2.5. We'll learn how to perform an exact match search and export the search results to a CSV file. We'll also see some additional design time features such as setting special values for date columns as additional filters, column search for related information, and personal form and advanced query selection for the application that you access from the search results. To perform the tasks in this tutorial, you must have installed JD AdWords Enterprise One Tools Release 9.2.5 and enabled feature security for the Enterprise One search user defined object. Let's first take a look at our search group. For the purpose of this tutorial, I've already created a search group that we'll use later to search for sales orders. For information about how to create a search group, see the tutorial creating a search group on learnjd.com. You can set special values for the date columns in the additional filters section of the search detail and related information tab. Let's see how you can do that. When defining related information, use the search field to search for the columns that you want to map to the search results. The search field supports the type ahead feature. In the action tab, you can now select a personal form and query for the application that you want to access from the search result. For this example, we want to use this personal form and this query for the P03013 application. You must select a shared personal form and query if you intend to publish this search group. Let's save this search group. We'll see how we can use this search group to search for sales orders. Let's locate our search group. Next, we'll see how to perform an exact match search to narrow down the search results. Later, we'll learn how to export the search results to a CSV file. Use this toggle button to turn on or turn off the exact match feature. We want to search for orders in the New York area. Let's enter NY and search. You can see that there are 19 records that meet our search criteria. Now let's turn on the exact match toggle button. Note that the search results have been narrowed down to show only the records in the New York area. To export the search results, use this icon. If the enable data browser go to end, jazz.ini setting is set to true in the server manager. You can specify the range of data that you want to export. You can either export only the current page or all the records from the search results. If this jazz.ini setting is turned off, you can only export the data that is displayed on the current page. For this tutorial, we have set the jazz.ini setting to true. Let's export the current page. Let's open the CSV file. You can see that the search results have been exported. Similarly, let's export the related information for this record. If multiple related information definitions are available, you have the option to choose a specific related information definition to export or all the related information definitions. It's important to note that if the enable data browser go to end jazz.ini setting is set to true, all the related information records from the search results will be exported when you click OK. Otherwise, only the first 100 records will be exported. You can see that the related information has been exported. This is the related information that we had defined for this search group. Let's now access the customer master application. You may recall that this is the personal form and this is the query that we had defined for this application. To learn more about Enterprise One Search and user defined objects, visit us at learnjd.com. Thanks for watching.